Hello everyone. Today is May 4th. It's a Tuesday. Um, I have two things going out today. Things that I sold on eBay. Um, so I'm just going to jump right in because I have a lot to do today. But the first item is this Heyday branded phone case. It is like a purple color, silicone kind of material. It's for the iPhone 6, 7, and 8. Not a big sale. This sold for $4.49 plus shipping. I got this in a box from Bulk. Um, I do buy liquidation stuff sometimes. If I got it from Bulk or if I got it from liquidation.com, I will mention those because I think everybody knows about those websites. Um, they're not a super great place to get stuff. I tried them out. I uh, probably won't do it again. I've had some luck on some stuff, but most of the time I don't make a lot of money. But um, So anyway, I'll mention those. If I get stuff from other liquidation companies that took me a long time to find, I'm probably not going to share those because I put in a lot of work to find them. So, um, But they're out there. Alright, so the other item that I have... Um, I got this from that resale shop that I cleared out. This is a handmade stone backgammon board. And um, I'm pretty sure this is like handmade or homemade, just judging from way that the way that the back looks. You know, there's no brand on it. This back part isn't finished. But these do sell. I like the colors on this one. There's a real pink, pretty color to it um, and then there's the little pieces and then the little dice for it the numbers are like scratched into it so that's another reason why I say that this is a handmade set this is really cool I like backgammon I used to play backgammon with my dad when I was a kid I don't really remember how to play it anymore but I have his old set and um, I would probably keep this for myself except you know, I need the money. So anyway, this sold for $74.99 plus shipping. And it looks like they paid about $45 for shipping. Um, that's a lot. I'm hoping it won't really be that much. But, you know, this is heavy. It's big. It's, uh, I think I added about three inches on each side to the dimensions because I will definitely be double boxing this so that'll make it about 22 inches long 18 inches wide and then about 7 inches thick so that's definitely going to put it over the 36 um, but like I said, I mean, you know, I had one customer who I originally had had this priced at um, maybe $90 or something. And I received an offer for $60. And I counteroffered. I said, hey, I can do $75 on this. Um, I realize that this is an expensive item. So instead of like counter sending a counteroffer, I declined. But I sent a message and said, you know what? I'm just going to change the price on this item to $75. You know, you can give you some time to think about it. And I did that because I knew I had three watchers on it. And I just had a feeling that it would probably sell to somebody. And the guy wrote back and he's like, can you do anything about the shipping? And I said, well, you know, I can't. I mean, it's just, it's a larger item. And it's going to be partially because, I mean, it's big anyway. But um, I will be double boxing this. So it's going to be a big package. I want to make sure it gets there safely to you. And I'm not going to cut corners to save money on shipping. It needs to get there safely. And um, I I don't even think it was that person that bought it. Somebody else bought it. And they, they were willing to pay that on shipping. So when you guys are shopping on eBay, I mean, keep that in mind. Something has a higher shipping cost. Um, it's usually due to the dimensions. So unfortunately, that's just... That's just the way it is. Shipping prices are getting crazy. But yeah, with this, um, I'll have to see what all supplies I have on hand. If I have any styrofoam, I'll probably sandwich this in styrofoam and then wrap it with bubble wrap. 
put it in a box. Um, I think I can probably use a couple of the priority game boxes. Put this in that and then double box inside of another box. So I would wrap that, wrap that first box with more bubble wrap and you know just anything i usually have a wide selection of things i get donations from lots of people as far as um packing material goes so i usually am able to get pretty creative so i'll um i'll wrap that second box with bubble wrap and stick some more styrofoam in there if i have some and uh put all that inside of a second box and cross my fingers and say some prayers and hopefully it'll get there safely but um yeah, so that's how I'll ship it. So anyway, I'm going to get busy on getting these ready to get out. I have a lot to do today. So um, anyway, if you like this video, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks.